Our purpose is to develop football. To develop football means to, to boost the interest in all countries in Europe. How do you boost the interest in all countries? How do you develop players? You don't develop players if they know that they will lose every match anyway. You develop players if they have chances to compete, to win. And by ranking, by, by setting up the, uh, uh, the UEFA Nations League and ranking the teams according to uh, their sporting results, with then by creating four different divisions with promotion and relegation, uh, you play for something, you compete for something, you play against teams which are more or less of your level and you create a new uh, champion, the Nations League champion as well, every, uh, every second year with the four uh, winners of the four groups in the top division playing a final four in, the June, in, in June of the, of the odd uh, years. So you create a new and additional element for promotion of uh, national team football. And does it devalue existing uh, championships, Euro, Euro championship, world champion? Is there any concerns there? That no, it, it, it doesn't, at least uh, from the feedback we, we receive now, it doesn't at all because um, it, creates, it just creates a new, uh, a new stimulus, a new, uh, it's, it's something new coming up without, again, without adding on number of matches and so on, uh, but by creating an interest, by creating an interest, which actually is a win-win for for everyone. F a FIFA bought into this idea, or not really? Do they need to be bought in? They don't need to be bought in. It's a decision, uh, a unanimous decision of the 54 European associations, which was taken at the last uh, uh, UEFA Congress. So this is uh, the way it will um, it will go ahead. <laughs>